to battle! Button up! Charger ready! Gun it ready! Load it ready! of the shell, as well as the additional damage it causes. If you compare the two types of shell that your tank is equipped with, you can see that the currently selected shell causes more damage. However, this will not help us to destroy the tank if we cannot penetrate its armor. Now, Look at the armor penetration of the shells. The second type of shell can penetrate far stronger armor. Even though the first type of shell causes more damage, it would not be effective in this situation. So, shells with better armor penetration should be used. Switch to the alternative shell type available. Load on the pit! switch to composite shells. These shells successfully pierce almost any armor, but they cause lower damage. Target damage! Armor piercing loaded! Load armor piercing! Target hit! Armor piercing loaded! Destroy the target tank! We hit! When 
shooting at long distances, you need to take into consideration that shells do not fly straight, but follow a parabolic path into account, meaning that they will fall to the ground once they pass a certain distance. For the shell to reach a distant target, the cannon should have a higher elevation. Accordingly, when you aim the targeting crosshair in sniper mode, or when the cannon orientation marker points towards the target, you will not be able to hit it. The shell will fall without reaching the opponent. To hit the opponent, no matter how far away they are, move the white crosshair onto them. It changes color when it is over the enemy. And fire. For a better view of your target, the fired shell flies along a ballistic trajectory, while the reticule shows where the cannon is aiming. If you shoot at a distant object using the reticule, the shell will drop before it reaches the target. When shooting at long distances, you need to take into consideration that shells do not fly straight, but follow a parabolic path into account, meaning that they will fall to the ground once they pass a certain distance. For the shell to reach accordingly, when you aim the targeting crosshair in sniper mode, or when the cannon orientation marker points towards the target, you will not be able to hit it. The shell will fall without reaching the opponent. To hit the opponent, no matter how far away they are, move the white crosshair onto them. It changes color when it is over the enemy. And fire. The fired shell flies along a ballistic trajectory, while the reticule shows where the cannon is aiming. If you shoot at a distant object using the reticule, the shell will drop before it reaches the target. Target destroyed! Nice shot! Target destroyed! Great job! You won! Now you're a true tanker!